Let's find the mass of one molecule of benzene, that's C6H6. So we're looking for the mass of one single molecule of benzene. To do that, all we really need to do is calculate the molar mass for the substance, the C6H6, and then divide the molar mass by Avogadro's number. And that'll give us the mass of just one molecule of C6H6, benzene here. So let's do that. The molar mass for benzene. So we're going to add up the masses of each carbon and hydrogen. We have six carbons, six times 12.01 plus six times 1.01. So the molar mass of benzene, that's 78.12, and the units for molar mass, grams per mole. And let's multiply this by a conversion factor, because we know that one mole of any substance, that has Avogadro's number of particles in it. So we just multiply the top, divide by the bottom, which is the same as dividing the molar mass by Avogadro's number. But here we see that the moles cancel out, leaving us with grams. So we know we did it correctly. When we do that, we end up with 12.98 times 10 to the 23rd. The units, those are grams. So one molecule of benzene is 12.98 times 10 to the negative 23rd grams. It's a very small number, but molecules are very small. We could write this in scientific notation. We could move this over one here, change this to negative 24. And this would be the same number, just in scientific notation. Let's round this to 1.30, and we're done. We found the mass of one molecule of C6H6 benzene. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.